Hey guys, Wax the Bastard Airsoft here. And uh, as you can already notice, uh, today's review will be uh, of my Cirrus vest. Bought this off ebike.com for 79 bucks. And overall, I could have spent that $79 on something so much better. Um, now, this vest, I mean, I'm not bad mouthing this vest. It's an, it's an okay vest, I would say. Uh, I've had it for a long time, so it's kind of old. But it's an okay vest. And when I say it's okay, I mean it's only okay. It's not like something that I'd actually want to buy again. Uh, so let me just tell you reasons why. Um, and some things about it. Uh, as you can tell, it does have molly webbing on it. The unfortunate thing about this molly webbing is that the only real actual molly webbing you can use is the hydration here. Because everything else is sewn into place. Now, I realize that the pockets are where pockets generally are supposed to be, everything like that. But for some people out there, you might actually want, you know, um, pockets over here somewhere. But me, I'm fine with the pockets. Uh, yeah, that's it's okay for me. I mean, it's where that I want them. But still, it would be nice to be able to have other things. You know, I might want to get rid of these two and have a medical pouch right here, and get rid of this, have it over here, and put my M4 mags over there. You know, just it's completely not customizable at all. Um, it's made by Matrix, by the way. Uh, so yeah, uh, it does have a nice little Velcro piece right there, and ad admin pouch, kinda. You know, you can stick ID cards and stuff like that down in there. Uh, on the back, it has a built-in hydration carrier, which, you know, that's alright, I guess. I mean, where else are you going to have a hydration carrier? But, uh, the adjust is adjustable. One size fits all. Mostly. Some people are pretty big. Um, but going into depth, the main reason why I do not like this vest is because it is not a secure vest. And what I mean by that is it's Velcro. Velcro, after a certain period of time, wears out. So, to wear this, it just simply Velcros together like that. And what happens when this is your only vest and the Velcro wears out? You don't have a vest. Um, so, if you're going to buy a Sears vest, I seriously recommend getting one of the newer, better quality ones. Because the Matrix Tactical Systems one just really isn't even worth buying. Uh, that's just my input on it. And SAS Airsoft, let me make sure I'm getting your name correct. Because uh, I do not want to mess up anybody's name. Uh, you guys have noticed I never get well. Ah, uh, my bad. SAS1697 asked me to do a review on my comms. Or ever they may be. Well, uh, let me just tell you, there's nothing really to review. Uh, I think the brand is actually just called Calm. I'm not even sure. I picked them up at my army surplus store. It has a thick side or a thick side right here for you know protecting your ear over here, uh, and that's also where the microphone actually comes in. And this side over here is just normal. Uh, $15 pair of comms. I'm looking to get some Frogman ones, but uh, I can't really review my comms because there's nothing to review on them. Also, a uh, shout out to SAS1697. Uh, great stuff. Here, let me check it out. Great stuff. He got his hunting unboxing up, his Sig Sire P226 vest set up. He's got good stuff. Check him out good stuff subscribe to him and also I am now also partnered with army of one videos so check to him out sub to him he has got some good stuff up as well and also he's doing a loadout competition much like mine so uh, if you guys don't mind uh, send him your loadouts and he'll judge when he gets 25 subscribers so thank you guys for watching enjoy your evening have a nice day